there's something that I've been wanting to do for a little while, uh, and that is to test what happens to pearls when they uh, get put into these different solutions that we have. So I'm going to set up an experiment over here. Uh, I'm going to have a, a control and then uh, all of the different sort of chemicals that we have in the in the workshop, and just to see what happens to the pearls if I leave them there for um, for say an hour. Um, yeah. We'll see if they get damaged. <laughs> so here's the pearls. Uh, two fairly inexpensive um, necklaces. Oh, you get the containers. Okay, here we go. I actually probably should have done that one in glass because uh, I think the plastic is going to get destroyed as well. Uh, the pickle solution I'm using is actually the stuff that I've got um, here. So it's hot and it's, it's what I would, oh wow. They're actually fizzing up straight away. I reckon they're going to be. I reckon they're actually going to be gone by the time I come back to it. Uh, Activax. Let's just get some of the stuff out of here. So I've got some copper tongs for this uh, pickle. Uh, I just want to have a look at that real quick. <sighs> the ammonia had a very, very slight color change. The black one went a little purple. Rhodium completely destroyed. They're cooked. Uh, Activax, again, very slight discoloration. Uh, the, the white one went a bit yellow. Uh, pickle, very damaged. Matte finish. Uh, Metho, couldn't really see anything with those, um, but that's not to say that it hasn't reacted at all. Um, I just, yeah. Uh, acetone, same thing as the ammonia. There was like a very, very, very slight uh, color change with the black one. Um, you can see that one's a little bit darker than, than the control one. There's no point to this part, just don't do it. Plus it stinks to boot. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm going to do that again. <laughs> Hang on. Hold it up. Hold up. What? They explode?
<laughs> okay, all right. So as long as I've been a jeweler, I've I've never actually <laughs> I've never actually done that by accident or on purpose. Um, so that's a, that's a new one for me. I've always been like super careful with pearls, but that's insane. They are, they are like gone. Oh, hang on. This is the biggest piece. Whew. Okay, well that's interesting. So, so that's the largest piece that's left of the black one. Uh, and I'll flip it over and give you a close up of it. You can actually see the inside of that is uh, is like a coppery brown, or like a, um, a goldy sort of brown, goldy black. Ah, so cool. I mean, like clearly never do it. In conclusion, I think that if you just look after pearls like they are going to get damaged by whatever chemicals you have around, then that's probably the best idea. Um, keep them away from heat, keep them away from the pickle and the rhodium. They will both destroy the pearls. That was crazy. <laughs> Definitely something that I've never had happen before. <laughs> All right, I will see you in the next one. Okay, direct heat, they just kind of... Ooh. Okay, that one just integrated.